I turn between VMware, VirtualBox, Hyper-V and Chemo for your virtualization needs. Let's delve into the ultimate showdown of features, performance and usability to help you choose the best fit for your project. What specific aspects are you most interested in comparing? So hey guys and welcome in this video where I will show you how you can choose the best virtual machine. First of all, you have just to open your browser and dive into VMware, VirtualBox, Hyper-V and Chemo. So, choosing the right virtualization platform can be challenging, especially with options like VMware, VirtualBox, Hyper-V and Chemo on the table. Each offers unique features and capabilities scattering the different needs, whether you are an enterprise user, a developer, or a hobbyist. In this comparison, we will break down their strengths and weaknesses to help you find the perfect fit for your virtualization platform project. Let's dive in. The first one we have VMware. VMware is a leading virtualization platform that enables users to create and manage multiple virtual machines on a single physical server. So we have here in the home page the smarter way to cloud. Our private cloud solution delivers the security and agility enterprises need, supported by technologies for applications, each infrastructure, and a private EA. Then if you scroll down, you will find introducing VMware Cloud Foundation 9. Forthcam involves the future of VMware Cloud Foundation, the business value of VMware Cloud Foundation. We have also cloud solutions for your business, app platform, cloud infrastructure, networking, security, software, defined edge. Then if you scroll down, we have find also trending topics like EBM and VMware help enterprises adopt generative EA, announcing general of policy of VMware Private EA Foundation with NVIDIA. Then we have VMware Cloud Foundation total cost of ownership with people. Then we have Sovereign Cloud's new developer data and security services. And that's it. So a few more benefits include enhanced resource utilization, improved scalability, and reduced security features, making it ideal for enterprise environments. VMware tools such as vSphere facilitate effective management of virtual resources, ensuring high availability and disaster recovery. Additionally, its seamless integration with cloud services allows organizations to adopt hybrid cloud strategies, optimizing infrastructure while supporting innovation and agility. And we have the second one, which is VirtualBox. VirtualBox is an open source virtualization software developed by Oracle that allows users to run multiple operating systems on a single physical machine. So in the homepage, we have here various things. Like in the right, we have Get, get Started and you click over Download. We have your Download VirtualBox, binaries and platform packages. We have your powerful open source virtualization for personal and enterprise use. Then we have your community, documentation, training, and if you scroll down, also you'll find join the VirtualBox community. So its key benefits include being cost effective as it's free to use and offering improved compatibility with various host systems like Windows, Mac OS, and Linux. VirtualBox features an intuitive interface Snapchat capabilities for easy state restoration and seamless integration with the host system, which enhances productivity. With support for a wide range of guests, operating systems, and an active community for resources, VirtualBox is a versatile choice for developers and teach enthusiasts alike. So let's move on to Hyper-V. So Hyper-V is a virtualization platform developed by Microsoft that allows users to create and manage virtual machines on Windows Server and Windows 10. So if we scroll down, we found here introduction to Hyper-V on Windows, also reason to use virtualization, system requirements and operating systems you can run in a virtual machine, differences between Hyper-V on Windows and Hyper-V on Windows Server. We have limitations, 
next step you have to install Hyper-V on Windows. So Hyper-V is a virtualization platform developed by Microsoft that allows users to create and manage virtual machines on Windows Server and Windows 10. Its benefits include tight integration with the Windows ecosystem, enabling seamless management through family tools like PowerShell and System Center. Hyper-V offers features such as live migration, which allows virtual machines to move between hosts without downtime and reduce security options like shielded virtual machines. Additionally, it supports nested virtualization and containerization, making it ideal for port enterprise environments and development scenarios while providing scalability and high availability for demanding workloads. Then let's move on to the last one which is called Kimo. So in the homepage, we have a generic and open source machine emulator and virtualizer. If we scroll down, we will find here full system emulation, user mode emulation, virtualization. So, Kimo is an open source machine emulator and virtualizer that enables users to run multiple operating systems on various hardware. Hardware, I mean architectures. Its key benefits include flexibility as it supports a wide range of guest OS types and architectures from ARM. Kimo can operate in two modes. First, as a full system emulator for running in modified guest operating systems, and the second one as a lightweight virtualizer when paired with KVM. So what is KVM? KVM is kernel-based virtual machine. For improved performance, it's highly configurable and can be integrated into cloud and container environments, making it a powerful choice for developers and researchers seeking an adaptable virtualization solution. You can just get started if you want. So the best one, which is called VMware. So VMware is often regarded as the best virtualization platform for enterprise environments due to its obvious features, including high availability, disaster recovery, and seamless cloud integration. Its FISFER management capabilities optimize resource allocation and performance in heavy workloads, while strong security measures protect sensitive data. Additionally, VMware supports hybrid cloud strategies, making it ideal for organizations seeking flexibility and innovation. Overall, its performance and comprehensive support make VMware a top choice for service virtualization needs. So this is how it works with VMware, VirtualBox, Hyper-V, and Kimo. So this is it for this video, guys. I hope it has been useful and helpful. See you guys in the next video.